Hi everyone, welcome to Design School MC. In this video, I will show you how to create a shield icon design using vintage style. Okay, first select the pen tool over here, click here, click here, scroll like this, click on this point, and click here, scroll like that, click on this point, and close this point. And I will change the color, double click on the fill and scroll on the gray color and click OK and duplicate this object, go to edit, select copy, edit, pitch in front, click on this point and scroll like this. OK. And select this object, go to per finder and click minus one, uh, I mean click unit to combine this object. And now duplicate this uh, shield, go to edit, select copy, edit, pitch in front, click on this point and scroll a little bit down, click this point and scroll a little bit going up like this, and select this shield, change the fill color to stroke like that, and change the size of this line, maybe 8, maybe a little bit bigger, 10, um, okay I think that looks good. And now I will uh, create object using rectangle tool. You can press M on your key. Click here, scroll like that. Okay, like this. And I will uh, change the white color to stroke, click here. And double click on the fill, scroll on the white, uh, I mean scroll on the gray color. Click OK. And change the size of this stroke, this line, 10, like that. Okay, I think that looks good. Uh, maybe I will put this object a little bit going up like this. Okay, maybe a little bit down. And now I will create a line using rectangle tool. Zoom in. Click here, scroll like this. And I will remove this gray color. And change the stroke color to fill color like this. Okay, like that, and I will duplicate this line, go to edit, select copy, edit, pitch in front, and put on the right. Maybe a little bit on the right, like this, and select type tool to create text over here. Click here. Vintage. Change the size a little bit bigger like this, and put on the center over here. Change the size a little bit uh, small and change the font style using another font. You can click here and your you can looking for your best font over here. Click on this name and scroll down on your key. I think this font is looks good. Maybe I need to change the font style, uh, the size of this text a little bit bigger like this. And I will put on the center, zoom out. Maybe I will re remove this line and I will change that line using star object. Click and hold in this tool and change to star tool. Click here. Okay, click OK. Put this star over here and click on this point to change the size a little bit small. Put over here. Change the size a little bit small, zoom in, and click on this point, and scroll like this, to change the rotation of the star, and go to edit, select copy, edit, pitch in front, zoom out, put the star over here, maybe the star a little bit on the right, okay, I think that looks good. And select the shield, uh, double click on the fill, scroll on the brown color, change the color using brown color like this. I will copy this color code, right click and select copy and click OK. And select this object, double click on the fill, right click on this dialog box, click page, click OK. And this line 2, double click on the stroke, right click on this dialog box, click page, click OK. 
that looks much better and this vintage the text I will change the color using uh, white color okay like that maybe I will um, create another text over here I will duplicate this text go to edit select copy edit pitch in front and put this over here and change the size to bigger maybe like this uh, I will block this text you can press ctrl E on your key and change the text um, maybe design tutorial okay you can using another uh, name you can try using your idea click on this point and scroll like this to change the size of this text maybe I need to change this text uh, using another font style click here and scroll down on your key maybe this font is looks good I will try to change the style using bold click on this point and scroll like this put this text on the center okay like that I think that looks good and this vintage I will change the font style using uh, this this font right click select copy select this text right click over here and select page enter okay and change the regular to bold and click on this point and scroll like this to change the size of this uh, text okay and I will create new text I will put over here click here uh, 3017 put over here change the size a little bit bigger zoom in a little bit down Maybe I need to change this text uh, using white color. Double click on the fill and scroll on the white and click OK. Zoom out. That looks good. And select the pencil over here. Uh, maybe I need to select this shield, this object, to change the fill color using brown color like this. And select the pencil. Zoom in. Click here click here click here here and here click here close this point uh, maybe I will go back click on this point click here click here click here and close this point select direct selection tool to edit this point a little bit here okay and this point two put a little bit going up like that and this point a little bit down I think that looks good maybe I need to change this point a little bit going up and a little bit on the right I think that looks good I will copy this uh, object go to edit select copy edit it's in front click on this point and scroll like this okay like that and put on the right maybe like this zoom out okay I think that looks good Okay guys, this is the basic how to create a shield icon design using printed style and you can try to create a printed icon using this technique but different shape and I hope you learned something in this video guys and if you have with my video tutorial don't forget to click like, share and subscribe my youtube channel to get new video tutorial every time I update new video. 
and you can go to my YouTube channel in the Science School MC. You can type the Science School MC in YouTube search and go to my YouTube channel. Watch more video tutorial. See you on the next video.